in the city of Denver ban fracking or ban all oil and gas production. Uh, but, uh, but if we don't do this at a, at a larger scale, hopefully globally, then as we continue to munch up dinosaurs and spew them in the air, we will continue to hurt our habitability on the planet. We are facing uh, some pipeline build out here, the Penny's Pipeline and the Adelphia Gateway Pipeline. These two threaten to use eminent domain on residential and farmland. This is problematic for many of our citizens and it all really stems back to fracking. Stopping the rollout of uh, fracking infrastructure is important for two reasons. One, to really protect the health and safety of our residents. Uh, we know that living close to or within 2,500 feet of oil or gas operations, you know, puts you in line for really deteriorating health effects. Uh, from a broader perspective, um, our residents really care about taking substantive action to address the climate crisis. The fact that this line three will have the equivalent uh, climate impact of bringing 50 new coal plants online is just, you know, it just boggles my mind why anybody would support this. I'm very hopeful that uh, President Biden will perhaps cancel this and, and send Enbridge packing home. So I am asking <laughs> the federal government, the Biden administration, our political leaders, um, at the state level, at the national level, to, to lead, to do their jobs and to lead us forward toward a caring economy that will be sustainable and, and address the global climate crisis 